Today I will show you how to install MOBA XTROM software on Windows 10. Now go to Chrome and search MOBA XTROM download. And MOBA XTROM, this is the official website link. We just click on it. We, uh, we can see there are two versions available one is free and one is professional version uh, I am downloading home edition this is free version and you if you needed professional edition then you can download it there actually in no differences on feature and the only differences is uh, the session and we just click download now and mobile extreme home edition we are downloading the installer edition you can also download portable edition i just downloaded installer edition or installer file just downloading Now open the zip file from here and we can see there is MSI file available in there. We just extract and install just we just make a folder so that uh, we can extract the files organized way and we just double click on MSI file next accept the term next next and install our mobile term is now successfully installed just search it in here mobile term preferring for first time startup it's very lightweight you know just first time you it's take time to in uh, to start up and we can see the terminal is here here is a very nice and organized uh, terminal on mobile extreme uh, if you need any type of session you just click the session any type of you can say telnet rdsa is rdp this is for windows uh, vnc ftp sftp serial when we are uh, doing work with a console then we are use the uh, serial option for it wsl for windows aws s3 uh, we have on uh, ssis uh SSH machine so we just click on SSH the IP two four one you can specify username you can uh, specify username in here you just loaded your uh, username and password in there we just create one so that you can understand what i am want to say uh, our machine new scss i new session we just give one name it's it's silly thing we just username is root password is something and click ok now every uh, every time you can use this username and password to log in the session so that uh, you have no work you you cannot do work every time just put username and password every time see this is 
very nice terminal you can make the folder to organize all of things in here lab 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 mc lab machine this is the lab machine this is also a lab machine actually this is my lab machine so i just make organize in one folder and this is the production server save with production server and that every time when you are uses when you use just organize way you can uh, you can make it very organized way now it's happen now we can see we have a dark and light uh, we have a dark and light theme in here so just select display window dark trim dim screen there are many several theme is here you can just select any on as per your uh, needed i like dark theme that's why i select the dark theme in here also many many option in available in here so if you have time you just see one by one and i think it will be helpful for you when if you want to same command execution different different terminal you can do it you can do it by multi exe system so that one command you just put every terminal just what happen cd etc ps system see you can see and you can exit if you want you can exit uh, the multi execution terminal so that we can put the command one by one it will be i think it will be helpful for you thank you